Three Kiwis have been awarded one of Australia's most prestigious war honours. They helped rescue Aussie troops from certain death during the Vietnam War. And for Maurice Stanley, the award was timely. Tim Lamborn explains. Oh, Vietnam veteran Maurice Stanley wasn't expecting much of a fuss when he arrived at the East Coast Bay's RSA today. But Maury, along with radio operator Willie Walker and gunner Murray Broomhall, were awarded the Australian Unit Citation for Gallantry for their heroic efforts in the Battle of Long Tan. I knew there was something on. Uh, my wife wouldn't even tell me what was on. So we had a discussion as to whether I'd wear a suit or a jacket, and I lost. <laughs> On the 18th of August 1966, 105 Australian troops were taking on more than 2,000 Viet Cong. Stanley and his two Kiwi mates were fighting alongside the Australians, and Stanley led the artillery fire with such accuracy they were able to drive the enemy back and limit casualties to just 18. I wouldn't be standing here to talk to you now if Murray had not been able to direct the 24 artillery guns as well as he did. The unit citation for gallantry has been awarded only twice before. This informal presentation was specially arranged because Stanley is terminally ill with cancer. To receive a citation from the country in which I trained and represented New Zealand and fought with in battle, to me, that is most extraordinary. The Governor-General will formally present the citation early next week, but for Stanley and his comrades, today will be hard to beat. Tim Lamborn, 3 News.